Welcome to Digital Asset News. My name is Rob, and today what I want to talk to you about is not so much about the serious side of the crypto market, but I want to talk to you about a project that I've been involved with uh, for months and months now. And I like, I love this project. It is called These Nuts. And not everything has to be so serious and so stringent out there. This is a great project that really has a, a really good feet on the ground uh, for what they're trying to do as far as uh, utility and then charity, inclusion, and of course, as you can obviously see, a lot of humor. And uh, in our bear market right now, this is something I think we are dire, direly in need of. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to uh, bring a couple of the uh, founders on and they're gonna talk about the project itself. I have been involved in the project for about eight, nine months now. That's my NFT in the upper right-hand corner that you can clearly see, and uh, we'll get to it. And also, as uh, just a, a quick mention, is that this is the premiere right now. So. In the premiere, you can see that I'm here right now with you uh, answering questions in the chat. But if you want to go to the actual live Q&A, there's two ways to do it. First of all, if your autoplay is on, you don't have to do anything, it'll go right to it. But if your autoplay is off on your phone or desktop, you just have to click on the video that pops up right after this. And once you click that, you go to the live q and I'll be there, and then the, the founders from uh, These Nuts will be there, Papa and Cookie. So just click that after the video. So without further ado, let's jump right in to the interview. All right, everybody. So what's promised, what I want to talk to you about is that uh, different projects that are really making, trying to make waves in this market. Let's be honest, it's not the best market we could possibly be in. But as I've always said, it's uh, bear marketers for building or build a bear. So, of course, like we were talking about, I got uh, two of the gentlemen here from These Nuts, the uh, NFT project. Gentlemen, thanks for coming on. Cookie and Papa Nut. Hey, hey, hey thanks for having us. <laughs> yeah. So let's start with this. This is already already scrolling through. People don't really understand like what is these nuts and uh, why what makes it unique besides the name. Then we'll talk about how is these building for the future specifically because this is an NFT project and we like to know how things are going and what the utility is. Then how is these making an impact, uh, especially with the things that you're reaching out to for different genders. And lastly, let's talk about a real quick giveaway: two nuts and two ladies. So first things first. Gents, I know what this is. I found you guys months and months ago. And uh, I got to tell you, your, your Discord, not everything has to be so damn serious, really what it comes down to. So when I found your Discord, it was like it was like a weight off my shoulders. I had just moved to Puerto Rico, just found out that my, my dog had cancer. I was going through oh. some, some problems. And I found you guys on like that night. And it was like, it was a revelation. It was super funny stuff. I saw cookies, memes, and everything else. But then there's some backwards. So just tell people, Cookie, we'll start with you. What's these nuts? What's the elevator pitch here? Man, uh, when I when I got into these, these is uh, right out the gate. I mean, was such a straight up meme project um, and a huge part <laughs> of community building. I mean, I mean when I when I when I got in, it was the first thing that I just started pounding away at was doing gifs and memes, and then it just blew up to. I mean, astonishing. I mean, you, you, you found it. <laughs> I mean, yeah. we went, I think, uh, on Giphy, um, at 20, I think we're up to 28 million, uh, views now on the, <laughs> yeah. on the deeps Giphy. It's, it's a roughly around 28 million now. Um, and it just grows every day. Um, Jeez. the other thing, the other aspect behind it too, was, you know, the $50,000 to fuck cancer. I mean, that was, that was one of the biggest things right out the gate. That's crazy. Um, there's tons and tons of, uh, of stuff in the background that Papa has been working on. Um, and I mean, he's the man. He's 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 done a lot of stuff. There's so much to go over. I mean, it's it's mind boggling. Well, it's true. And uh, Papa, I'll get to you in a sec, because like right now, this is when everything happens. Right. The bear market, the people that that are giving up, of course, they won't be around with the bull market. That's fine. But the ones that want to put in the time are the ones that are going to reap the benefits. So, Papa, tell us real quick, a little bit deeper. These nuts and what's going on. Yeah. You know, and C Cookie said it great. Like Cookie actually came on. He was like one of the first to mint in and like he just started adding so much value to that community. It was like a no brainer. We added him to the team immediately. Like he was just such a rock star. Oh, yeah. Uh, and and D's started, you know, it's kind of an OG project. It started when the markets were a lot different than they are now. Right. It's a bull market. Um, and our team started using our expertise and worked with a lot of celebrities, uh, Ashton Kutcher, Mia Kunis on Stoner Cats and Jordan Belfort, uh, the Wolf of Wall Street and uh, professional basketball teams. So we like we worked with a lot of people. 
Um, but at the end of the day, we, we wanted to focus on the amazing community that Cookie and so many of our mods have built. Yeah. Uh, and just like you said, uh, Rob, like it didn't have to be so serious. Like we all of a sudden I looked around and we were building like a family and it was fun. And so we really started doubling down on building out this D's ecosystem. And uh, so now we're just so much more than just even D's nuts. We have like a floor that uh, among multiple different collections that yeah. range like from almost nothing to uh, one ETH floor. So, you know, our project really has something for everyone. Um, and we can talk more about like kind of the utility because we're not just a PFP project. You think D's nuts started out as a meme, uh, but we're not, <laughs> we're not anymore. You know, we're, we're serious about our nuts. <laughs> cool. So, so how about this? Before I get the cookie and we start talking about how, is, how are you guys building for the future, talk real quick about the utility because that is the big thing, the big knock on NFT projects. So just real quick, give us an overview. Yeah. So, you know, like what's really cool and exciting about Web3 is it's, it's the future, right? So there's so much potential there, yet we're so early phases that the bar is really, really low. Right. And so for us, that was just super exciting because we started innovating and being some of the first in the world to do those things that we're doing. So um, so like the D's Nuts actually has a, a, a staking feature where you can stake your PFP and earn our utility token. And that utility token actually can be used in our shop to buy NFTs. Um, and we were one of the first in the world to do this part, which is you can actually customize your NFT on chain. So you can buy new backgrounds, you can buy music, you can buy new traits, and you can on-chain customize your NFT, sell the old parts, or sell the new parts if you want on the secondary market and make money. Um, and that's just one of our utilities. Uh, we, we have our metaverse coming, um, uh, our, our 2D profile pictures. We, we're releasing 3D profiles with those, and those are 3D meta-ready files that you can take to any metaverse just about. Um, so we're actually doing like a VR chat party, which you should join us. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, we're going to live stream it and just have a blast showing off like, hey, these are meta ready models. So you can take these and represent them in your favorite game. Um, we got the charity component. We got so much. I just want to look forward to talking a little bit more about it uh, and just a bit about uh, kind of the ladies aspect and how that expands this whole ecosystem. Perfect. We'll get to that in a second. So let's get to the, the second one. Excellent responses, gents. So for the future because right now let's be honest this is a bear market i think it's gonna get worse i could be wrong hope i'm wrong but here we are and i gotta tell you this is one of those things where i'm glad that we have a little bit of brevity to the situation so cookie just real quick what do you see how are you guys doing this for the future or how are you building this up especially the community um you know with just like papa said i mean you know he 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 slipped a couple of little aspects in there about the uh the metaverse and the uh the vr um so a lot of that, you know, he's prepping, you know, for the future. And then also um, another big component, too, is our Discord. We're, you know, we're hammering hard on Discord uh, with our projects. We, you know, we did a merger where we brought in our projects together to try to keep all the family together. Instead of so many people having to join, you know, so many different Discords. Um, so we've been, you know, prepping that for the metaverse and our future ladies drop and the juniors and so forth. And... I mean, really, the community building is is the biggest thing right now um, because a lot of people don't want to sit on Discord right now, um, you know, being in this bear market. So um, that's one one major component in building for the future is, is uh, you know, keeping those those members and those families close and and uh, giving them something still to do. And then um, I'll push this one over to Papa because this is definitely a good one for him to talk about about our future. So even for me, I know that like my views go down, subscribers go down in these bear markets, but I'm okay with that because in the bull markets, these are one of the tourists come. So right now, the people that we build around here, this is our base and you guys are still growing, which is pretty impressive. So I like to see that base. I like to see it actually grow. So Papa, uh, expand on that. How are you guys building for the future? Yeah. And, you know, like you said, like it's harder to get eyes right now. It, you know, it's it's harder to get more attention. It's harder to get people who aren't just scared. Are you going to rug us or is this going to be a flop? Am I going to waste my money? Yeah. All those kinds of things are more challenging. And like you said, though, we're on the same like I think why, you know, us and, and you get along so well is we're just we're realists. We treat this as a real business. We're OK with that. Like we're not going anywhere. We're all doxxed. Our mods are doxxed. You know, our team is doxxed. I'm doxxed. Um, and so for us, uh, I'm okay with the market. I'm, I'm, 
I'm building this and I've scheduled our drop money, the money we make on these drops. I've scheduled that out to, to run a real business. I'm, I'm not reliant on a, a small dip in the market that's going to put us out of business. Like we're seeing a lot of NFTs just close up. They don't want to bleed any money. Yeah. Um, yeah. Our project's bleeding money right now, but we prepared for that in our drops. That's part of our business plan. It's part of business, right? And so I find there to be a lot of advantages during this kind of market. You can kind of clean house a little bit of, of fixing some problems, you know, with, with their co smart contracts, you, you know, uh, and, and these kinds of things. But we've seen tremendous growth even in this bear market. We've seen 50,000 something plus added to our across our socials. If you look at our ladies uh, Twitter that we launched just a few months ago, we have a juniors account we just launched. That's already up to like 28,000 or whatever followers. So, I mean, we've acquired 50,000 new followers in this bear market. We're, we're getting, I think. Cookie said something like 95 whitelists just yesterday of people interested wanting to get our new project ladies. So we're, we're seeing a really positive response. And I think it's just uh, projects like ours that believe in this future um, that are going to get the attention. Yeah, and and I, I, I told this to you, you and I talked about this before the call. It was like, you know, back in the, the dot com bubble when that was popping, mm. it, it didn't mean you didn't believe in the Internet. It didn't mean you just fold the cards and throw everything out and be like, hey, well, I'm this, the Internet thing was a fad. It didn't work out. I told you so. Yeah. And I see some people doing that with like Web3. It's like, ah, oh, well, the bubble crash. I told you it wasn't going to work out and move on. But for us, it's like I believe in Web3 long term. We're here to stay. And, and I want to be one of the pioneers that are pushing the space. Oh, yeah, exactly. Like, I mean, in 2018, everybody told me what a moron I was for investing in a Bitcoin. Like, see, you can't just invest in something that doesn't make any sense. I'm like, well, maybe I'm going to go dollar cost average. I'll see you in 2021. Here we are. But we're, yeah. Everything comes full circle. All right. Yep. So, so, gents, let me, my, my, one of our last questions is, is how are you guys making an impact? I know you guys are trying to so push different aspects about this as far as inclusion. So talk to me about that. And then Papa or Cookie, you guys can take whichever one you want to take this. That's fine. Sure. So uh, especially like I want to talk about our ladies a little bit because that's our newest drop that we're doing. Uh, LadiesNFT.io. Find us on socials. But we're here to make a big impact. So we already have the D's nuts in our ecosystem. And now we're launching uh, uh, the ladies product line, which is going to be the kind of a female company to the D's nuts. Uh, and for us, we really want to do it just like we do everything in our company with a really authentic, uh, authentic um, perspective. So we hired like pretty much an all-female team, um, the smart contract developer, the artist, the website developer, um, the modeler, like is, you know, within reason, like there's some dudes working on the team for sure. But like we try to hire as many females for those positions as we could to try to bring more female inclusion in Web3 um, yeah. because they're underrepresented. I think the last study that was done was something like 8% of art being done in the Web3 spaces by women. Um, hmm. so that, that's a problem. Um, so we wanted to address that. We're also raising and pledged, um, uh, another $50,000, uh, to our partner F cancer for women affected by, by cancer. So ladies is, is making an impact in that way. And then lastly, we're, we're committed to giving back to our holders because we wouldn't be anywhere without our holders. Sure. And so we're making an impact for our holders, even in this bear market. Um, we're pledging to give out a quarter million dollar. We have a quarter million dollar plan to give back to our holders through NFTs and money uh, or Ethereum anyway. And uh, part of that is you'll be able to take your lady, uh, initiate a breeding function. You'll get free juniors NFTs. These are free NFTs you can sell or it gives you access to our play to earn game. And our play to earn game uh, is going to be giving out hundreds and hundreds of dollars every single day. It's not like a grindy game. It's not a pay to win game. It's not like... You can spend eight hours on it yeah. and always win. It's like literally you go to the bathroom, you pull up your phone, you play it for five minutes and you win money. It's that simple. Um, and so we're going to be giving back to our holders that way. And, and I tell people like even in a bear market, like if this project doesn't moon and we don't have thousands and thousands and thousands, you know, tens of thousands of people want to get in. That's still good for you if you hold because you'll get paid every day for playing in the competition. No, there's no competition. So yeah. um you know, that's how we're really trying to make an impact for, for, you know, inclusion in the space for our holders and, and for those less fortunate, you know, facing serious issues like cancer. So that's, that's really how our project's trying to make a difference. Awesome. And I know you guys have already, I mean, you're talking about a quarter of a million dollars and you guys are already ramping up to that, to that point. So that's pretty good. You know, uh, Rob, and there's something we should probably just mention right now before we wrap this, uh, big news. So we, so we haven't told it anyone else in our audience about this or any uh, of our holders in our D's ecosystem about this. So maybe now is a good time to drop that 
it's Pretty always a, on your show. Always a great time to drop new info. Let's hear Ooh, it. Okay. This is a good one too. So uh, our holders in our ecosystem know we're already working on the metaverse. Uh, mm -hmm. Actually, we got a trailer dropping here really soon. Uh, but what nobody knows about is is the special thing we're throwing in for for ladies holders. So ladies has a breeding function, and if you hold a D's nuts and a ladies. You'll be able to breed juniors. Everybody knows this in our ecosystem, but what they don't know is once you breed a family, some uh, nuts and a, and a lady and a kid, okay. you will qualify for a free metaverse house. So we're going to give you a free NFT, which will give you a free house in the metaverse if you hold a family. And that's just kind of our way of saying thank you to our loyal holders, to people in our ecosystem. We're all about adding value back. And uh, I think this will be a super cool surprise for people who, who have wailed into our projects and look forward to wailing into ladies. Um, there's going to be some real benefits for you. Perfect. Wow. There we go. So there you go. So you gotta, <laughs> that's a lot of stuff going on there, gents. So you got, uh, so for your, uh, for, you have to have a D's nut, you have to have a ladies, then that'll, that'll uh, make a juniors. And you have those three, give you a free house in the metaverse, which is coming out. Uh, soon, I assume at some points. I know these are these are long yeah. processes, but uh, sure, long processes. You know, so we're going to kind of roll out out in stages. We were going to do a grander metaverse uh, first, uh, mm -hmm. but with the bear market, it doesn't make sense to try to roll out plots and sell them for a lot less than we could in a in a bull run. Yeah. Um, so what we want to do is use our, use the metaverse for our ecosystem, give them free value, give them free utility allow us to kind of use them as beta testers to yeah. really grow this thing. And then it, once the bull market comes back, we'll be in a prime position to launch and capitalize on that. Fantastic. And so will our holders. Yeah, that's good news, especially in this bear market. People could use a little bit of uplift. So I yeah. uh, appreciate that, which I guess would leave me the last thing was do a giveaway. So this is very simple. So uh, we already talked about this, uh, me pop and cookie before. There is going to be a tweet looks just like this. And do just as it says, just follow at D's Nuts NFT, uh, follow at News Asset and retweet and we'll randomly pick uh, four winners, two nuts and two ladies. And I got to tell you, nothing better than that. Pretty free, pretty easy, pretty simple. So gents, any, I think we've said it all. I think we've said it all. We've said it all today. Anything else? I just want to say about? a big thank you to you, Rob. You've uh, been in our community. You've, you've always said nice things. I think you, we even sent you a Nut Buster video shirt. Yeah, everybody thinks that's funny. I'm like that's not funny. That's serious stuff. You respect that shirt. Yeah. So I just want to thank you, and uh, there's really no way I can thank you other than you know. So I'll I'll do it by giving a thousand dollars to charity. Uh, so if you you pick a charity, I'll donate a thousand dollars of your choice. We'll post that out to social once it's done. But uh, let, let's that's the least I can do. Make an impact and, and thank you for for putting us on your show. Excellent. Sounds good. All right. Well, gents, I, I cookie. Anything yeah. else? It, it was awesome. I appreciate you having us on as always. I mean, I can't say anything else other than thank you. I mean, yeah. Awesome, man. You guys are welcome. I will see you in the chats. All right, everybody. So that's it for today. Again, you can find the link to that tweet itself in the description below. Remember, just follow these nuts, news asset, retweet, pick them at random, two nuts, two ladies, and that is it. So thanks so much, guys. I do appreciate it. All right, again, so right after this premiere, we're going to be doing the uh, Q&A. You can ask me any questions. You can ask Papa. You can ask uh, Cookie anything you want to, and we'll go to that live premiere. Again, if you have your autoplay is on, it will go right to the premiere. If not, you just click the video that pops up right now. So thanks so much for watching. See you at the Q&A.